Hey guys, this is Developer Dude, and today in this video, we are going to discuss about HTML entities. HTML provides some method to display reserved characters. Reserved characters are those characters that are either reserved for HTML or those which are not present in the basic keyboard. For instance, greater than is reserved in HTML language. Sometimes this character needs to display on the web page which creates ambiguity in code. Along with these are the characters which are normally not present in basic keyboard. HTML provides some entity names and entity numbers to display these symbols. Entity names are case sensitive. Entity numbers is easy to learn. This is not full table with all HTML characters entities. But all the HTML character entities are given in the HTML basics for beginners book. Link is in the description. Reserved characters. These characters are either reserved for HTML or those which are not present in the basic keyboard and can't use them directly. Non-breaking spaces. It is used to provide the space that will not break into a new line. This HTML entity is represented by and NBSP that will separate the two words and will stick together without breaking it into a new line. We can also use the non-breaking space for preventing the browsers from truncating spaces in HTML pages. The non-breaking hyphen is used to define a hyphen character that does not break into a new line. If we used to write 10 spaces in our text, then browser will remove 9 of them. In order to add real spaces in our text, we can use the character entity.
diacritical marks a diacritical mark is a glyph added to a letter diacritical mark like grave and acute are called accents it can appear both above and below a letter inside a letter and between two letters diacritical mark can be used in combination with alphanumeric characters to generate a character that is not present in the character set used on the page Thanks for watching.